for like 10 minutes, okay? Because I have something very important to accomplish in here and it requires absolute silence. So, can you turn off the TV, please? Is this gonna get you a job and get you the hell out of this house? Yes, eventually. Sounds like more of your bullshit conspiracy theory. Okay, all right, look. Investigations, Zana, right? Okay, it's conspiracy investigations. Not more important than John K plus eight. Mr. Karlinski, hello. My name is Lenny Mercer, and I am a huge fan of your work. I've been following your investigations ever since uh, the Oklahoma City bombing up to 9 11, and uh, even your more recent findings regarding the FEMA. You alone, sir, have inspired me to become a professional conspiracy investigator, and I'm about to unearth rock solid evidence of a major worldwide conspiracy. The culprits are none other than the Xanders Corporation. That's right, the largest retail company in the world, and I've got a way in. A friend of mine, Roy Winston, is the night janitor at the corporate headquarters building, and he's just hired me on to be his personal assistant, so I will have access to Xander's most classified documents. Now, I've also been researching the actual building and its architectural design. I believe that there is a hidden floor within that building, specifically the 13th floor. Now, what is on that floor? Theory number one, the Bilderberg Group, I believe, could be holding their secret meetings on the Xanders, in the Xanders building. After all, Xanders has a major impact on the world economy. Theory number two, FEMA could be breeding and training up an army of children on that floor for when they implement police state four. You're a bunch of animals. Whatever it is, it's big. So, I'm sending you copies of all the evidence that I've found. Now, my life is in danger as we speak, and I have yet to step foot in the building. So, if you don't hear from me within a month or two, I've been murdered. And my body disintegrated in acid and or fire. So promise me that you will follow through with the investigation so that my death won't be in vain. As your most avid follower and fan, dare I say sur surrogate son, I humbly ask you to grant me this one request. Because I count it as a privilege and an honor to stand alongside you in this fight against the New World Order. Sincerely, your friend and colleague, Leonard Mercer. Okay. 